The fennec fox lives in one of the hottest environments on Earth, the Sahara Desert. Daytime temperatures can soar far beyond what most mammals can tolerate. Yet this small fox thrives there, thanks largely to one striking feature, its enormous ears. At first glance, the ears look oversized and almost comical, but they are not for hearing alone. They are highly efficient cooling devices, acting like biological heat radiators. The fennec fox's ears are packed with an extremely dense network of blood vessels close to the surface of the skin. When the fox's body temperature rises, warm blood is sent into the ears. Because the skin there is thin and exposed, heat escapes rapidly into the surrounding air. As air moves across the ears, even a light desert breeze, it carries that heat away. The blood cools, then flows back into the body, lowering the fox's overall temperature. This process is similar to how a car radiator releases heat to prevent an engine from overheating. The large surface area of the ears makes this system incredibly efficient. Compared to the fox's small body, the ears provide a huge cooling zone. The hotter the environment gets, the more valuable that surface becomes. The ears also help reduce the need for sweating or heavy panting, both of which cause water loss. In a desert where water is scarce, conserving moisture is critical for survival. Passive heat released through the ears allows the fox to stay cool without wasting precious fluids. At night, when temperatures drop sharply, the fox can reduce blood flow to its ears. This limits heat loss and helps maintain body warmth. The same structure that cools the fox during the day helps prevent chilling after sunset. Hearing is still an important bonus. The large ears can detect faint sounds of insects and rodents moving beneath the sand. But temperature regulation is the primary evolutionary reason they grew so large. The fennec fox doesn't fight the desert heat, it redirects it. By turning its ears into living radiators, it stays cool, hydrated, and active where few mammals can survive. Like and subscribe for more curious science videos every day.